What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode in our Dead by Daylight series. Uh, today we're doing some killer gameplay. We're going to be playing as the Legion. We do have the brand new uh, Eternal Blight skin as well, which is very nice. Probably my favorite skin out of all of them, uh, which is the reason why I already uh, invested in it. I hope that you guys like it too. Uh, originally it was intended to do some Blight gameplay, but some things came up, so we thought I'm good with Legion. We'll stick with Legion and see how we get on. Uh, don't forget guys if you're new to the channel don't forget to leave a like and a subscribe obviously uh, join the discord group as well if you want to be notified on uh, new um, new content and obviously if you want to find survivor friends teams it's very helpful for that as well um, so today we're going to be doing like a gen slowdown kind of build with legion and the perks today that we're using are as follows the first perk we're using is discordance essentially uh, every time there's two or more uh, survivors on a generator it'll be highlighted in yellow we'll know that there's somebody over there uh, corrupt intervention so at the beginning of the game when we're uh, starting and it's a little bit slow uh three generators will be uh blocked so they can't be worked on thanatophobia just because it's a staple when you're using the legion uh especially when it goes hand in hand with his ability we're going to be uh getting good hits in and it's going to slow down their uh their healing speeds and their and their uh gen repairing speeds as well and we're bringing stride as well a because we didn't have nurses calling b because we didn't have ruin and c because again i think it's going to go a little bit uh hand in hand with his ability uh we're going to have a lot of people injured and we're going to be able to hear them about 20% uh, better. We're also bringing in the Blight Serum in this one as well. We're going to be seeing if we can get some value out of that. One of the new add-ons that's in the Eternal Blight. And we're going to be bringing the Petals as well so that we get a, uh, a, gen, uh, sorry, a hook that comes in and spawns in. And we can get some extra points. With that being said, guys, let's get into the gameplay, shall we? Looks like we're back in on the Larry's Memorial Institute. Take a look at that skin, guys. It looks amazing. We already find the Cheryl working on one of those pumpkin gens. Let's see if we can get a little bit of value out of the Blight Serum. It's quite a shame that we can't land a hit straight off of that. Um, she does manage to get the pallet down. Let's see if we can give chase here. Discordance lets us know that there's two people working on a gen here. The Claudy gets greedy. I think there was someone hiding behind me as well. Let's see if we can get it down. Five generators still remaining. That looks like the Cheryl. Big swing. Nice dodge there. And we do get the down. Nice first hook of the game coming in. Okay, I did see Discordance, but we were just not quick enough, unfortunately, to get over there. And is that the Cheryl? That's a little bit cheeky for my liking. Trying to get a chest there. That's going to be your second hook. Sucks to be you for not having a uh, decisive there. Okay. Wasn't trying to camp them out. That was a pretty hook, uh, pretty fast hook rescue. I was trying to uh, get out of there, but uh, it looks like the Kate wanted to make the save. So we're going to make chase here. Causing some, uh, some decent pressure early on. Are you going to get the the palace you are very nice <laughs> decent work in the pallet can we bait it a little bit are you gonna vault she does vault it's like my favorite thing to do as a killer epic mind gamer first hook for the kate and there's the cheryl again is that the chest you're trying to get into Vault build, it looks like. That was very quick. And again. Very nice. You're going to make the save as well. Greedy. Greedy up by the Cheryl. I don't want to be a tunneler. Let's see if there's someone new we can hit. Is that the Fang or the Claudy? Looks like we hit the Fang. Dead hard, but we still managed to get the hit there. I do feel bad about that. I do not like it when it happens to me. First hook for the Fang. K coming in with the flashlight. And uh, she obviously has a death wish. Okay, we'll take your decisive. That's if you have decisive. Destroy that as well. One less pallet on the map. Just our luck that we get an indoor map. Okay, all three of them over here. Let's see if we can get some uh, some chain hits. 
Okay, we'll vault that. Okay, we stab Fang in the back. Very nice. Discordant's going off. Oh, we just missed. I got a little bit. Uh, I got a little bit anxious that the time was going to be running out. Probably could have brought an add-on that would uh, make my feral frenzy go a little bit longer, uh, and that would have been really, really handy. Either that or uh, something that makes uh, makes them go into like, the deep wounds, uh, so it's even again even harder for them to heal. And uh, again, that's creating more slowdown for us. And as you guys know, the gens are going so, so quick. We're back on the Cheryl here, which I feel really bad about, but she has been terrible all game. Let's see if we can get her out of here. Okay, you're going to do the pallet. We'll pretend we don't see the pallet. Very nice. You're such a good looper, Cheryl. Pretty sure I saw Kate here on my left as well, pretty sure. There's the Fang. I don't know who to give chase to. They obviously won that pumpkin, Jan. I, maybe I should let them have it. The Fang's healing behind the window vault there. I kind of saw you. She vaults back through. Okay, someone's healing upstairs. I'm going to let the Fang go. Okay, that's the Cheryl on my left. A little bit of lag there. The thing's back again, dead harding away. Okay, we managed to get her through the window. Okay, Blight Serum again. Almost caught up there. She keeps running up this way. It's not exactly a great loop. She should be focusing on uh, using her Vault Build. It's definitely Vault Build. Especially on a map like Larry's. Wow. So we do manage to get the Cheryl out of the game. That's the Claudette. I guess she didn't know that she was going to be Death Hook. She was looking to make a quick rescue there. Definitely a survive with friends confirmed. Scratch marks everywhere. Kind of losing track of who I should be following here. They should be doing generators, but... I uh, don't even give them too much credit. A nice little gen grab there. Did she not know I was nearby? What the hell is that? Boil over coming in clutch for her. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get her to a hook here. That's so far away. Good for the K. That's pretty decent. Let's see who else we can find. Discordance going off again. Ooh. It's pretty difficult to control the Blight Serum add-on, but I'm enjoying using it. I definitely think it would be really, really good on someone like a, maybe a Ghostface or a, maybe even a Myers. Claudette just escapes the swing. Swinging through every pallet and window. You know what these hitboxes are like. We miss again. She's going towards the left side. Third time lucky. Uh, we're going to be able to hook the Claudia here. DC on first down. We're back on the Kate here. She really should stop running around. She's not that great in chase. We found the. She's led us right to the Feng as well. The Feng's a little bit bad, to be honest. I do rate the Feng. Oh, maybe I'm giving you a little bit too much credit. We do get an easy hit there on a really unsafe pallet. You almost got me. Slow vault, or at least a medium vault. And that's going to be the thing out of the game, sadly. Leaving just the Kate, and I believe it was the Claudy. The Kate comes in with a, with a pallet stun there, out of nowhere. Was that live? Bit of a decent, uh, decent boost you look like she got there. After vaulting, are you not? What the hell is going on? I think they're throwing. That is pretty much going to be the end of the game. I have no interest in trying to hunt down the hatch in this one, especially on a map like Larry's. We'll go with our uh, three kills and be happy with it. We're back in again on another indoor map. What a nightmare. I'm trying to do a, uh, make a video here 
and uh, we get um, the Hawkins. Uh, we get the Hawkins lab on the on the second uh, try. This is terrible, terrible news. Really difficult for me to uh, track people down early on as well. Let's get uh, some value out of this uh, blighted, uh, blight, blighted serum. See if we can close a little bit of distance. I know from my experience playing as a survivor, whenever uh, um, corrupt intervention is, is brought in, it tends to be uh, where the survivors usually kind of spawn in, so I get a rough idea of where they're going to be. I think someone was just breaking that totem there. How dare you! Okay, clicking away and we get an easy hit. Are you okay? What an amazing looper we've got here. Go on, throw your pallet down. Another stun, uh, another uh, flashlight blind there from the Claudie. She's very good. I thought she was doubling back on me there. I guess not. She ran upstairs. I can hear the steel grates. Okay, she's just running aimlessly. She's already made the vault. Not as good as you think you are. Maybe I get. Maybe I spoke too soon. Nice little lock attack. That was very nice. Maybe we are getting some decent uh, caliber survivors for you guys today. Okay, we should better get the down here. Very nice juice. Moonwalking as well. Definitely a PC gamer. Higher quality uh, survivor today. Serum coming in clutch. We didn't quite get there again in time for the um, to be able to stop them from getting the generator done. I'm not tunneling this, Claudia. It was an accident. I don't even know what she's doing here. I was patrolling upstairs, and she comes running right into me. What the hell was that? Somebody upstairs on the generator. Looks like the Nia. This is a horrible 50-50. Are you going to play this? It looks like she is. Straight down the stairs, you're going to be greedy. There's going to be a pallet on our right. Very nice. Okay, pallet down. She's running. That's a smart way to go. You do not want to get caught in that room. That's not a very safe pallet at all. Okay, let's see if she knows how to play this. Okay, not bad, not bad. Balance? No, nope, no balance. But there's two, two pallets in here. This is a very strong loop. She did pretty well with it. Kind of wasted it though. I would have ran to the next room, and in here it's an even stronger loop, right? The two, uh, the two. Um, thought she was baiting the pallet, but I guess not. The two uh, safe pallets, and then there's obviously the two staircases as well. Plus the vaults. She's gone into another 50-50. This is a terrible room. Okay, can we make a? Can we bait it? Yeah, she's already jumped down, and that's going to be a down. Terrible room to be in. There was two stronger rooms just there. She could have been in. They probably could have killed a lot more of our time. A lot more of our time. Anyway, uh, two generators completed. Just the three remaining. So much for a gen slowdown build. I'm pretty sure there was somebody back here. I'm getting pulled in many directions. Let's use the frenzy a little bit to traverse the map and maybe cut a little bit of ground. The Nia thinks she's smart. I need to get somebody out of this game. Super, super immersed gamers. I don't know how they're hiding on that. This nice little pallet stun. This is another 50 50. What are you doing? I guess the Nia doesn't know the difference between strong tiles and weak ones. You do not want to get caught up here. But then again, is there a hook even nearby for me? I feel bad. This could be the end of the Nia. I do feel bad. I guess her friends are coming to save her. Good old survival friends uh, team. A toxic bill appears. I'm happy to get some free hits, guys. I'm happy for her to jump out. I do not mind. I'm happy to get some free hits. This is very nice, Valley. I haven't been able to find these guys all game. Are they throwing or what? Maybe we should hook the Claudy. Very nice. That's the Claudia out of the game. I didn't even realize this could be the near gone too. That was her first, it looked like her first hook. First hook, second hook. Why were they body blocking like that? It's just her second hook, especially the Claudia when she was death hook. Risky plays. I'm guessing the bill's still up here. I could kind of hear him coughing with my headphones. Here he is. Okay, you're vaulting back through. Easy downs, boys. Easy downs. 
boys and girls. Okay, look at this, Claude. Super immersed. Hiding behind every barrel. Let's see if we can give a little bit of decent chase here. Probably shouldn't have used my serum here. I was trying to use my frenzy. But it's the same input button. So it looks like we've lost her there. She's going to get the unhook here. We'll let her get her down. Sorry, buddy. But I'm guessing you have decisive anyway, so you should be fine. Probably unbreakable as well. Claudia is terrible. Terrible movement. I'm sure you and your friends bully a lot of killers, but not today. It's not to be. Or at least Jen rush a lot of killers. Okay, when to pick up the bill when he hit his unbreakable. Very nice timing, I guess. We'll play around with the bill a little bit. I do like bills. Bill mains are always fun. Let's let him run a little bit. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> He's running into no man's land. That pallet's already gone. Claw deck down. The Nia's probably going to go for the save here. This is big time pressure. The Nia was fully healed. Very nice. I don't want to. I don't really want to tunnel this bill. I feel bad doing it. But if you want the 4K, yeah, you can point all you like, sir. I know, I know. The knee is going down as well, though. Don't you worry, buddy. You can blame her. Swing through that pallet. Didn't quite get the hit, though. Brutality stacks. Very nice. She's already trying to get the Claudie up. And that, my friends, is going to signal the end of the game. We'll do a little bit of clean up here. Get them all on their hooks. And that'll be the end of it. Don't forget, guys, we've got the uh, first ever live uh, Twitch stream coming on Sunday, the 1st of November. So only a couple days time uh, by the time you see this video. Uh, we're going to be filming, uh, we're going to be streaming, I should say, uh, from 2 to uh, 4 p.m. I hope to see you all there. Be there or be square. Uh, it's going to be a hell of a lot of fun and we're going to be... Um, Rushing all the way up to uh, path, uh, on our path to affiliate, looking to get 50 followers. So, um, you know, if you guys want to come by and show some love, that would be really, really amazing. Thank you again for your time, guys, and I will see you all in the next one.